Post columnist, Miranda Devine, who joins us, as you can see, from Des Moines. Miranda, good morning to you. Tell us about why these young men and women are so interested and so singularly behind Bernie. Good morning, Steve. Look they are millennials they don't really know much about life they're terribly idealistic and they see in bernie sanders someone who's been consistently a, an idealist a socialist all his public life and they admire that and the fact that he hasn't changed and that he seems authentic he is authentic in the same way that donald trump is authentic and i think that appeals to them uh, they're lost they're looking for meaning in their lives and they see a politician who seems to be different from the other democratic sure. politicians, not so polished. And they love it. And I think if he doesn't win, they are going to take to the streets in fury. And do what? Well, do what they've been doing to President Trump, you know, just having a tantrum like millennials seem to yeah. like doing lately. Well, and, and you write in your column, you know, uh, regardless of the fact that he honeymooned in the Soviet Union and he's going to spend $50 trillion on everything, they haven't really, you know, and you talk about it, they haven't really experienced life, so that just seems like okay, it's okay with them. Look, he's promising to cancel student debt. Uh, a lot of them are students and he's promising to legalize marijuana in every state what's not to like if you're a slacker millennial okay uh so your estimate is real quickly tonight well look bernie sanders definitely has the momentum he's got yes. the biggest crowds um everyone's talking about him and i think you can tell by the fact that the democrats are changing the right. rules now to allow michael okay. bloomberg in and they're pretending that iowa doesn't matter all right but it matters to us miranda thank you very much